Okay. Now, next we have on someone that's really, I know, is going to turn my stomach even more than this last Frico. He's known as Mr. Jim. And where do you see him? He is truthfully a, a very sick man. He's the leader of a satanic cult. Bring him on. Where is he? Bring him on. Bring him on. Where, where is this? You are actually the leader of a satanic cult. Is... Boy. Hey, he looks like he's, he's the leader of the seven dwarfs. You will pay a heavy price for your blasphemy. Oh. The true God. Hey, I... The hey. true God will take care of you hey, I... and all of you people. Oh. Satan in this room, you pearl Satan. Now, do you, do you, hold it. He has spoken to me, and I know the truth. Satan has, has spoken to you. Satan has spoken to me, and he has spoken to millions through the centuries. No, no. Do you actually, do you actually head a, a, a satanic cult? That is true, Wally, and I have a mission. And that mission, oh, 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 that mission is to teach the truth. That Satan is the only God, the all-powerful God, the all-knowing God. Oh. He says Satan. He says Satan is the only God. Hey! Hail Satan! You know what? There is nothing worse in this great country of ours than to be teaching or worshiping Satan. Is there? No! There is nothing worse than phony beliefs and false gods. Are, are, are you like Jesus? Like God? Are like you, the comic books called the Bible and the Old Testament? Are you saying? Wait. Are you saying? Wait a minute. Are you saying Jesus and God are phony? They are absolutely untrue. Oh! Myths created by stupid, weak human beings oh, you. who have yet to see the glory of Satan. This, this, you little pervert, is one nation under God. You will learn to love Satan before you die. I will Satan learn. Satan will rule before we die. Before you die. Do you truly? How long have you belonged to this religious, uh, to this satanic cult? Yes, please, do not misinterpret my understandings. Uh, my understandings are Satan rules, and he has ruled for centuries, and I have become aware of his leadership through the last years of his teaching. How many years have you belonged to this satanic cult? It is none of your business, Mr. George. Answer my questions, or I'm going to kick your blasphemous buns out of here. Now, night. Now, I understand the worst part. Hold. The worst part of it is I understand that you have been going around recruiting young people, young people, teaching them the truth. Hold. The truth. You've been recruiting the truth. Teaching them the truth to love Satan, to understand his oh. power, his glory, his wonderfulness. He created the universe, and he rules it now. Do you know... Do you know something? You and people like you are so repugnant and so repulsive, I would like to kick you out of the United States for the rest of your life. If I have anything to do with it, there will be a new United States. Don't you want to have plans for this United States that you claim to love so much? We 
are going to move the Capitol to Salem, Massachusetts. We are going to rip that flag down that you worship so much and replace it with a pentagram flag. We are going to do away with all your churches and convert them into shrines to the glorious one. I want to tell you something. When George Bush is sworn in as President of the United States, I have news for you. You better start running because President Bush is going to get people like you and he is going to he throw you. He is powerless. You. He is powerless. He is powerless in the light of the great one, the magnificent one, known through the centuries as being powerful. Even early Christians knew of his power. Lucifer, the highest angel. Hold on. You, you are the prince of sickness. I'll be right back. There we are. Thank you very much. What is, what is this stupid sign that you keep giving? Hold up your sign. What is that? that I am the son of darkness. Oh. Hey, he is the son. He He's the son of stupidity, is what he is. No, no, I understand that you all... The truth will reveal itself to disbelievers The like truth yourself. has already revealed itself. You're an idiot. No, I understand that you are... You're a member of the Church of Satan. Is that correct? That is correct, sir. Do you, do you, do you conduct satanic rituals? One of ritual? the few things that you are correct about. Oh... Do you, do, you hold it. do you conduct satanic rituals? We conduct activities that go along with our religion. Uh, uh, what kind of things do you do? I'm not going to reveal all the details to you and this obnoxious group of disbelievers. I will tell you, though, hey, let me tell you. I will tell hold you, on, though, pal. that we practice the rights that we choose to, and neither you or your right-wing bozos will stop us. Oh. In fact, we will replace you. We will don't, you. don't condemn my eyes or you're going to go straight to hell, pal. By the way, by the, oh, by the way, are, are, are you prepared to burn in everlasting hell? Are, are you? I am prepared to go where my master sends me. In, in damnation, in burning hell. But that's where you're going. Satan created heaven. Satan created hell. Satan created the universe. If he tells me it is my place, I will go there gladly. Tell me this. Do you know what I understand? I read an article on this guy, and, and I want to ask him if this is true. He says one of his heroes, the people, one of the persons he admires the most, is Charles Manson. Is that? There are many people that have been spoken to by Satan. Charles Manson happens to be one. He is a very misunderstood man. Oh! As is Richard Mar Ramirez. And you, and you are a very, and you are a very misunderstood woman. As is you are. the son of Sam. As is the hillside strangler. As was Hitler. All misunderstood. By the way, where'd you get, where'd you get that smock from? Snow White? It is none of your business. You know what? But what really kills me, you ad admire... Something will kill you oh. sooner than you think. You will Don't not threaten go me. unpunished. Don't threaten you me. You will not go unpunished. I, wait, wait. Are, are you threatening my life? I am saying that the master has his way oh. of dealing with ignorant people like you. Do you ever, when you do your, your satanic rituals, do you ever do any human sacrifice? Of course not. Although, shh, shh. although, How about, yes, there are certain creatures of the earth that would not voluntarily join our activities. Do you get the feeling, hey, do you get the, do you get the feeling he's trying to threaten me, do you? Let's go to the You audience. will be paid. You will yes, be paid. Yes, yes. As will all other non-believers. Oh, oh. 
My name is Liz, and I want to know if you're looking forward to burning in hell for all eternity. Well, I am looking forward. Will that make to you happy? my master sends me. What? Oh, whatever your master does, you're a joke. I laugh at Satan. Looking Shaden. forward to where he sends me is better you're than you, you looking to forward to your to false your beliefs. Fun. You're a weakling. You I laugh. Have you're false a joke. Beliefs. You believe in a comic book God that does never exist. Oh. Oh. I'd like to reiterate. I like the first have word you on your T-shirt, red. Have you ever? The greatest oh, part of oh, Have you ever participated in human sacrifice? How many times do I have to answer it, bozo? Oh. Of course I have. Not afraid. Well, what do you think my wait, master directed wait, me to do? Hey, hold on, Pat. Hold on. If you're not afraid, why won't you tell us some of the things you do do at your ritual? You will find out sooner than later, Mr. George. What do you do? He will reveal himself and his ways to all disbelievers within our lifetime. Do you worship? Do you actually get down on, on your knees and worship Satan? I pray to Satan. I bow to Satan. I love Satan. I love. I love Satan. Yes. Go ahead. Hi, my name is Phil. Yes. But you're so proud of yourself. Why are you wearing those dark glasses and the hood? What do you got to hide? Yeah. It is true. It is true that I must hide my real identity. For your right-wing fascist society has yet to grasp reality, and there could be ramifications you against myself and my followers. Know who you are? Hey, you know why he's wearing that hood and glasses? He's, he's so damn ugly, he doesn't want to show himself. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Listen, throughout time, people have known of Satan. People have worshipped him and loved him. Well, I've known you long enough. You can go to hell. You're out of here.